Lord, I come before you to everyone who's going to watch this video. I pray for them and their hair. Lord, you know that our hair sometimes, that's where our confidence comes from. You know, if you have long, beautiful hair, you feel very good if you have long hair. But sometimes if that hair is breaking off and that hair is balding and people can see the scalp, it makes us to lose our confidence. So I just pray for women out there that are watching this video, touch their hair. Touch them, Lord. Make their hair to grow. Make their hairs to grow out. You are the one who said, ask anything in my name and I will do it. You said it. You said, ask and you shall receive. So I pray for everyone who's going to watch this video. I know that most women struggle with ages. Lord, I know it's not a funny thing. I've also struggled with that for a very long time. And Lord, I know that the first thing that people look at, it's the edges. Lord, I know it's a very frustrating thing when you have used this, when you have used that, and it's not working. I know how frustrating it is, but we are coming to you because we know that you are the creator of hair. You can create hair on our heads. Let me tell you something. My hair, my hair doesn't grow. I've tried everything, especially my edges. They are borrowed like borrowed nears. <laughs> Child, I've tried everything. I'm very stressed. I even get depression with my edges because they are just borrowed. Everyone sees my scar. <laughs> Hello, my lovely people. Welcome back again to my YouTube channel. If you are new here, ha, ha, you have clicked on the right video. Child, click on that red subscribe button and on the notification bell beside the subscribe button because child, if you do this, ha, you will not miss any of my hair videos that I will post in the future. Now, also click on the notification bell. Click it on all because when you do that, you'll be the first one to notice my videos and the first one to comment. So click on that subscribe button. It's free 99. You don't have to pay anything. If you're my regular watcher, thank you so much for coming back to my videos. I really appreciate you guys. You're the best. You are literally legit. So guys, I've had so many people say, <sighs> I'm tired of my edges. My edges are falling out. This alopecia can't take it anymore. <laughs> what can I do? Cha. <laughs> you pray for it? Have you ever prayed for your edges? Or pray for your hair? Have you ever taken time aside to say, you know what? God is the one who created my hair. So I have to pray to God for my hair to be restored back. <laughs> Because, cha, if you are like me, if you have tried everything for your ages and nothing is working, <laughs> mm -hmm. the best remedy that never fails is prayer. Praying for your hair. Simple as that. Now, I've watched a video of this lady. I don't remember her name, but she has thick edges, guys. She has literally thick edges. I watched a video and I think I commented on her video. She said had problems with my edges, but I prayed for my edges. I was really, really desperate and I said, Lord, please help me with my edges. And now, <laughs> her edges are thick. Because what did she do? She did not just do this. Massage my scalp. She did not just apply green tea, which helps with the alopecia. She did not just apply onion juice, but she prayed. Now, I want to ask you a question. If you have watched all the videos, all the remedies that we put on YouTube, all the DIYs that people put on YouTube, and you see no change with your edges, and you start saying, ah, I'm about to give up. I'm about to give up. I'm super, super tired of trying this and trying that for my edges. They are not growing out. They keep on borrowing and borrow dear. But have you tried praying? Cha! <laughs> Try prayer. Because that can never, never, ever fail. If you have watched Selena Zenchak, okay? She is a YouTuber as well. She had a problem with her edges as well. And she said, I prayed. I prayed for my edges and I was really desperate. I said, Lord, please help me with my edges. And now, do you see any bold spots on the edges? Eh? Do you see any borrowed spots? <laughs> no, because she knew how to deal with the situation. She prayed 
before her natural hair and it grew out. Let me ask you a question. Remember the story of Hannah? Mm -hmm. If you're a Bible reader, you know what I'm talking. The story of Hannah, Hannah did not have a child and Penina was just, you know, doing this to her, right? Because she didn't have a baby of her own. Now what did Diana do? Did she go and say, I'm having trouble I don't even know what to do. <laughs> People are just laughing at me. Did she do that? Or she went to the right person? What did Hannah do when Penina was just laughing at her? She prayed until... <laughs> Child, you might have prayed for your ages, prayed for your hair. Maybe you prayed for three months. Nothing happened. <laughs> your ages are, are still borrowed like never before. Do you still pray? Or you say, you know what? This is not working. <laughs> Child believes it's not working. No matter how much I pray and cry, it's not working. You don't have enough faith. You understand? What did Hannah do? Tell me what she did. She went to the temple and she prayed until, until she didn't have any voice. She was voiceless. You understand? She didn't have any, any voice. Ah, she was just lip praying like, and nothing was coming out of her mouth. You might say, I have prayed for my hair, but have you prayed through? Have you kept on praying until God answered you? Just tell you something. I am a YouTuber that believes in God. I am a Christian. I believe in Jesus Christ. I believe in his word. His word said, if you ask anything, can you imagine anything? He did not specifically say, if you ask for this or that, but he said anything in my name, I will do it. That's what he said. So if you want your edges back, you have tried all the remedy, you have tried all the DIYs and nothing seems to be working. We have one thing that will guarantee 101% of results and that is prayer. You really have to get down on your knees and be serious and say, God, you said your hair is your glory. Your hair is your covering. So my edges when they are bold, my hair is not covered. My hair is not covered. People can see my scar. <laughs> my hair is no longer covered. So it's going against your word. Uh -huh. Yeah? You pray like that and you see. <laughs> it might take two years and two good answers, but keep on praying. Most of us give up. Maybe the answer is coming tomorrow and you give up today. You say, I'm sick and tired of praying all day. I'm tired. <laughs> and the answer is coming tomorrow. You have missed it. You see, you have missed your chance. You have missed your answer because you gave up quickly that hair comes from God. I've also talked about if I told you to count the hairs on your head, you will spend the rest of your life counting because you can't count your hairs are on top of your head. You can't do that. Only God knows the number of your hair. So you have to take it to him in prayer and say, Lord, I have watched all the videos. I have tried all that I can, but nothing seems to be working. I need something that will literally grow out my hair. God will show you. He might show you in a dream. He might make you dream a dream of you using this and this, and you use it and you see it's working, and you see your hair is growing back. That's God's answer. You might see a DIY video of someone, and you try it, it immediately works for you because you have been praying about it. Prayer is so powerful, guys. Do not underestimate the power of prayer. Pray for your edges. If you have struggled, God is still on the throne. Now, most of the people think that, why should you pray for your hair? So many people, they are struggling. They, there's hunger out there. So many people are struggling. They don't have food to eat. Why would you pray for your hair when other people are struggling out there? Let me tell you something, chap. God is interested in everything that has to do with you. No matter how big, no matter how small, no matter how you think, ah, even if I take this to God, will God say, will God really accept this? God is interested in every little thing that you think, ah, this, I don't think this is necessary. I just, he cares about it. 
Yes, he cares about your edges because it's in his word. Your hair is your glory. It is your covering. So if your edges are not covered, <laughs> it is just gone against God's word. It's not covered. Your edges, people can see your, your scalp. So your head is not covered anymore. You understand? I've also done a video on my channel about praying for your hair. I'll leave that video in the description box below. Go and check that video out. I also did a video on fasting for your natural hair. This, guys, this is super important. If you are really serious about growing your natural hair, you do exactly what I've said in this video. That you need to start praying for your hair every single day. Do not forget Every single day, ask God, Lord, my hair, Lord, my edges. I need my edges back. I've tried everything in the book. I've tried even castor oil, the gurus of oil. Kaka <laughs> Pias, I tried it. Aloe vera, nothing is working. God will show you what to use. So, guys, I hope this video was helpful. Please comment below and like the video. And also share this video to your family and friends because there are some people out there that are struggling with hair loss. So they might need to hear this video as well. So please share this video. And thank you so much for watching. I will see you, God willing, in my next one. Bye for now.